Okay, today I'm going to introduce you introduce a new software start RCDC which is applicable for the reinforced concrete detailing. Uh, in this software, we can export the data from mm, two uh, software named uh, Start Pro and ETAPS. So let's open the software. Start RCDC V8 I this software in this part project name will give a specific name building client icrc engineer ajman here we will select the file in my previous video i was wor uh, i was working on the mm, analyze and design part of the building so i will select that particular file here it's unable to read and live data because this file required to be analyzed first so we will open it and analyze the file analyze run analyze good person done apply ok yes yes now we can open it here name of the file building client icrc engineer name here we will select the previous file now it, it will be open it's open in the design element there is pile cut footing column and wall beam and slab through Stellar CDC we can uh, show the detail for this type of element. First I will work for column and wall to create project. Now in this software uh, two windows are appeared right side and left side and right side all the plan of the particular building shown here in the left side the specification the height uh, the material concrete M25 grit and steel Fe415 uh, Newton per mm square cover is 50. First, we'll start from the uh, settings and setting design setting. The member should be designed as a ductile member as per IS13920. Okay, again, setting reinforcement setting. Uh, minimum percentage of steel in the column should be from 0 0.424% as per IS 456 but in the practical set we are se selecting from 0.4% to 6% I'm not going to use 8 mm dia, 10 mm, 12 mm, 32 and 25, 16 and 20 I'm going to use for this particular project these are all the specification about the zone 1, zone 2, mid zone uh, length spacing means the spacing for the stair 125 to 300 ok uh, now I will come to the detailing portal. You can do through this uh, options. It's so easy. Now we'll start the design. In the design here, dead live root R6 mean response spectrum, NX a response spectrum method uh, have been applied in the previous video uh, for the seismic analysis. Dead load will select here live load R6 EQX. Electric along x axis and z axis. We'll select all. Go no there. Okay. Uh, we have option here view, edit the plate. We will mm, add from the analysis and uh, export load case in combination. We will go in this particular example for this option. Add from the template for regular circuit. This regular circuit will be rectangular. There is no any other circular shape, trapezoidal shape. So we'll select for regular circuit. These are all the coefficient which we have given in the previous software start pro uh, whatever we have given there all will be exported in this uh, software we will select ok now the design is appear here design is in, in progress after design uh, there we have read in blue color read means fail column and blue means f uh, pass and, and for the fail column we will i will show you one trick how we can pass them uh, the first way is to change the cross section of the member. Now, here is 600 by 600. We can select uh, 800 by 800. Uh, we can pass it. We will go 
right click on the section where it's going to redesign the section and in this redesign the section another way uh, windows appear here you will change the bnd the cross section of the member which is column 800 800 now we will redesign the section here redesign 800 yeah redesign column again fill so we'll give 900 by 900 now it is passed for all these columns you can go through this option now how you can generate the report the report will go for tech, uh, textile schedule as we select in the setting that was the ductile here also we are required to select the ductile option this should be designed as a detail only for the step 600 600 size of the column still is at number of steel die 16 mm lengths 16 at the rate of 100 center center 16 at the rate of 250 f for the mid spun of the column 250 material is concrete uh, 25 grit and uh, steel 60 grit or 415 uh, newton per m square this screen uh, this is uh, zoom detail drawing i will select only c1 i'm not going to waste time the rest you can do easily this relate to column same by 600 these are all the data related to the cross sections uh, main reinforcement and lengths or stirrup now we go for the elevation again i will select the c1 uh, start uh, section number one start bar number one this is the elevation uh, from foundation up to here this is elevation elevation uh, this all the bar die you can check here easily elevation project setting whatever we have given the first step all will be coming here we'll go to the design summary uh, the design beside this uh, load calculation 1.5 dead load plus 1.5 live load up to the end is all the related uh, size of the column material all the specification are inserted or loaded down in this uh, table through software it will go to the design calculation for load snapshot and uh, column size change we brought change only in first column that i i have shown in, in the first step of which the column were uh, was uh, failed from 600 into 600 change to 900 into 900 we just brought the changes in the uh, column section fail diagnostic these type of columns are fail you can do same as i did in this video fail diagnostic bill of quantity in the bill of quantity quantity bq report will select the bq summary reinforcement type wise level data here you can give the cost also i'm not going to give the cost just i'm going to know about the uh, concrete 145 and 26 cubic meter and steel 16 mm 20 mm total uh, weight, weight is this much and shattering for these columns are 860.28 uh, meter square thank you very much and you will see in my next videos all detailing reinforcement detailing f related to beams slab foundation and pile cup Thank you. Bye-bye.